Hi guys, so I'm back on here real quick to share some deals I did over at CVS Pharmacy. Where's your receipt? So, on my husband's card, I bought some stuff, and I'll just tell you everything I bought, what extra bucks to get back, and then I returned some of it, because I didn't realize one of the deals wasn't going to work out, because on the razors, there's the men and there's the women's, but the women's are on sale, but the men's are not, I guess, and I thought they were both, so don't make that same mistake. I'll tell you which ones it is in a minute. So, first deal that we did is on the Tide Pods. I'm going to show you how I did it on his and how I did it on mine. So I got this three in one, 35 pods, loads, bag of pods. These are gonna be Christmas presents for my cousin, so I don't mind spending a little bit. Cause I could buy them like a gift card or something like that, right? They use it once and it's gone. I get them this and they get 31 loads of laundry. What's a better value? I think this is. And the Tide is $14.99 on sale for Original price $14.99, sale for $13.49. Then we got the Cottonelle toilet paper. It's the big guy. It's the 9 equals 36 rolls. I got the Ultra Comfort because I figured they may like that a little better. I know I might. And it is on sale. It's $16.79 normal price, $10.99 on sale. Okay, next item that I bought, that's it. So I'm gonna need it. Oh, I'm just put it right here. I may need it again. Okay, next item I bought is I bought a Gillette Venus women's razor, but it's on sale. It's $11.29 normal price. But this is where I messed up. They're buy one, get one half. But I also bought a men's at $11.29, but you don't get the extra bucks back if you buy the men in the women's. So buy two women's, even if you don't have two coupons, just buy two women's and you'll get the half off and you'll get your extra bucks back. So I'll tell you what the extra bucks are later when I like I do my, my part of the deal. Then I bought CoverGirl. CoverGirl eyebrow pencils. The reason I haven't told you any extra bucks is because the cotton now and the tide is part of a big deal with something else I bought. Once I get to it on the receipt, that I'll tell you the extra bucks. The CoverGirl, they are $5.79 each. And then you get back an extra buck. Let me see what coupon came up. I had a $2 coupon for CoverGirl come off. There's a $4 on the app. Oh, it did work. The CoverGirl, the $4 CoverGirl did work. So you get a $4 and a $2. Now there is a $2 shop me. And if you don't happen to have one of the digitals or whatever you don't have, you can submit that way too. So there is, there is other options to get this coupon. And it is on... Uh, if you have the Alexa app and you do the coupons that way, you can do it there. Now I submit, even if I have a digital coupon, only because I don't consider that to be a rebate app. I consider it more like just money back for Amazon and I'll usually give it to me. So that's your call if you want to do that or not. So I did get the four and the two for that one and you get back. You get five for buying two. And you want to get these because these are the cheapest items they have. Now, if, they, if they're out at your store, get whatever works for you. Okay, for now. And then I got the Colgate toothbrushes. My store was out of the mouthwashes and a lot of the toothpaste and other things. So I got what my store had. They had toothbrushes. These are $5.99 a piece. And there is a digital coupon for $3.00. Off. Now you wanted to be able to get one mouthwash and one toothbrush if you wanted it all digital, at least. Now one person did it twice because you can do a limited two, and they did where they bought two toothbrushes, two mouthwash, and they had one digital for each, and then they submitted a shop meam for the other two. What I did, since they only had toothbrushes in my store, I did one digital and one shop meam, which is like digital anyways because you get the money back. So I just used my rebate money to pay for it to lower them out of pocket. And then on that, you get yourself back a $4 extra care buck for spending 10 on the cover girl. Then I got the Revlon product. Now get whatever you wanna get in the Revlon line that's 
cheap enough, not too expensive, but also to wear whatever you get with it. That's part of the spin 30 get back 10. It adds up to where you have enough for the $30. I get this, this is $9.99. This is the cheapest one, next to cheapest to what the video I saw was that she did. And you have yourself a Revlon Cosmetic coupon for $3. And you also have a $5 CRT. So you get $8 off of this. So it makes it $1.99 for this. Which is really good for Revlon. Because Revlon's expensive. But it's also part of the spin 30 get back 10 for the holiday deal. So that's why I bought the, what I bought. I bought the Cottonelle. And I bought the Tide. And that was part of my spin 30 get back 10 deal. And, and then I'll show you what I did on my Tide on my car because it's a little different. But the Tide had a $3 digital coupon. I may not have told you that. Not yet. Not yet. But then I also bought the Gillette Mach 3, which I returned the Gillette. No, I don't have it. I returned the Gillette Women's Razor, the one that I had. Now, the one I showed you was from my card. And then I returned the Gillette Mach 3 Razor for men that was $11.29 because they're not part of the same extra book deal so don't get them confused because buy two women's up buy one get one half if you want to do the Gillette deal then I had two Chic Hydro Silk in the Chic Quattro Titanium at one of each at $11.99 and $12.79 but I was like that's way too much money really with the deal and the grand scheme of things with my 10 off seven it was way over 70 anyways so I just returned it and there are coupons for those for the Chic for four dollars off each and you will get back i can tell you the extra books i still have it on my bottom of my receipt you get ten dollars back for that one yeah so i returned some of it like i said when i did that when i returned it all sorry it's over here I got back an $18.73 extra care buck for all the coupons. And $11 back on my car. That was well worth it. So now I got $18 to spend all in one lump sum. Eh, which is not really that hard if you do two, de if you do ten, two $10 extra buck deals. And one other deal that's... You all have to spend. It's easy to spend. I also, I don't know where it went. But I'll just show you kind of all this but there's a dollar extra buck if you buy two Hershey bars you get the dollar back and they are two for two so it makes it a dollar for two candy bars I believe is yeah it's two for two and then you take a dollar off and you get it for a dollar not a bad deal not the worst not the best and then on my receipt I didn't take anything back I kept everything I got but I got one of the soft soap body washes they are priced at $6.59 and there is a five off of two digital. On my store I had one soft soap and then I bought the Irish Spring Body Wash and it is $6.99. So if you can get two soft soaps, you're a little cheaper. But if you prefer Irish Spring because that's what you use, it's not much more to get this anyway. And then, so the five off of two will come off. You can mix and match. You can get one of each because that's all my store had. Literally, these were the last two bottles of them that they had left in my store. And they were out of the deodorant that's on sale. I was going to get that speed stick, but they were out. Because all the couponers had come in before me and picked it all over. And then, next thing I got was the these Tide Pods. I'll show you these. These are a little different. I'll show you how I did this one. Oh wait, this one's only 25 in there. You got a better, you got more in yours. But this is the Power of Pods. See, you only got 25 in the Power of Pods. So you may want to get the one he got, the uh, other one that I got. But either way, it's still a good deal because if you go to pngeverydaygood.com's website, there's a coupon for $5 back on these at the digital OTC off, right? So I clip that. And what it does is it texts you a link to your phone and then they scan the bar. What they do is they put it in like a CVS gift card and they scan the barcode and then it comes off and then they get reimbursed. Well, I didn't realize I had already had the digital coupon clip. I forgot I clipped it for Tide Pods. 
for $30 off, right? Well, the OTC officer's five, but it wouldn't come off for the full value. And I'm like, why isn't this coming off at the full value? What it did is it took $279 off. So to cover the difference of the Tide Pods, it took $279 off, which is weird. Don't know why I did that, but okay. So I still got a little, actually I got $5.99 off basically. If you want to do it that way, maybe. But you can't rescan after you scanned it once to get the Tide to work again. If you buy it on some, you see, doesn't work. Then I also bought the Cottonelle again, which you saw the same one. $16.79 normal price. Tide Pods are normally $16.99 for those. And they're on sale for $13.49. Hmm. And then the Cottonelle is $10.99. Yes, I did get it. Okay. Then the Gillette Women's. These are the ones that I was showing you about earlier. Get two of these at buy one, get one half off. So at the half off, it takes five sixty-five off. And then I had two three dollar one was for a Venus cartridge, one was for the Venus razor, but it worked. Anyway, so I had two three dollar digital coupons for this. And you get yourself back a six dollar for buying two. You get a six dollar extra care back for buying two of these. So that is a good deal. Then I bought the CoverGirl eyebrow pencils again. What you saw earlier. They're, they're $5.79. And I had the $4 and the $3. Four do, sorry, the $4 digital and then the $2 digital. Oh, and I forgot to tell you on his card I had a 10 off of 70. So that's what made it so cheap. And I didn't give you the total. I'll give you the grand total in a second. And then on my card, I also had, I also bought the soft soap and the Irish Spring, which you saw. I did the Colgate toothbrushes again, the $5.99 I did the Revlon, same product from Revlon. I had the $5 Revlon. So what I had in coupons, Irish Spring 5, CoverGirl 4, Colgate 3, Revlon 3, Gillette, Gillette 3, Tide 3, Cottonelle 2, CoverGirl 2, 10 off a of 70, $5 off Revlon. And I used a 10, a 10, a 4, a 3, a 3, and a dollar, and a 4 cent extra bite. So $14.50 plus $1.20 in tax. So $15.70, and then it took $2.79 off for the OTC offer. I used $3 in rebate money, which I should have used more because I forgot I should have used a little more. So it's $9.91 that I paid out of pocket for all of that. And that's well over $70 if I added up. It's a lot. See that. So it's a lot, a lot of money. But I did get the OTC. That helped. And then I submitted it to Shop Meum for the missing $2 cover girl and the Colgate. That's where I should have added an extra $5 dollar. So it really should have been $7.91. That's what I really paid. So I'll, whatever I get back from Shopmium, I'll just send it back to my payment method. And on his, he had the 10 off of 70 also. Let me see your receipts again. So on his big one, his out of pocket, he used $5 in rebate money, so $17.55. But I did that return. Now, where's the other one? Did I not give you that one? Hold on. Sorry, Jeff. Hold on. Okay. So I did the return. So 17. Sorry. So 17 50, And then I returned $11 of that. So it was $7.55 for his, basically, is what he paid for his. So basically, about the same as mine. So our deals wound up being very similar ish deal and I was gonna do there's an userin deal for spend 20 get back 10 again if you have a lotion here today that'd be really good to get but I never get those anymore I was gonna get it with my 10 off sunny but then I was like yeah nah because you only got two dollar coupon for that right now so it's not as good as it usually is but it's not a bad deal have a good day god bless